Keith Jackson and Blake Corum are deep, and that's what the tactic is going to be. The sky kick, no fair catch. It's fielded in a very short return across the third. Gets a couple of the intangibles in play. It looked like Caden Fakum came right up the middle, 30. Yep. Nobody picked him up. Again, let's remind him. Figures have a big role this year. Joins him in the backfield. Morgan on the run. Fires to the end zone. Touchdown! Oh, Keith, the tight end. It takes the Gophers just a couple of plays to reach the end zone after the block punt. Well, he had his choice either way here. Watch the back, Ibrahim go in the flat, then the tight end will drag to the back side. And I love the patience here by Tanner Morgan. I'm thinking, get the ball out to the back. He, look at him, he's wide open, but instead, he waits for the back side to open right there. And that's the experience in having Tanner. So here comes Brock Walker, who knocks the PAT through. It's for Minnesota. Second possession, Charbonnet in the clear. It's a foot race, can they catch him? Instantly, 70-yard touchdown run for the sophomore from California. What a scene opened up there by that old line. Yeah, there was some confusion with the secondary. Ben Mason, a fullback, lined up initially way out, pointing, making everybody on the same page. Nobody's there in run support. It's one thing to have that initial... Even though he played hurt, never really felt completely healthy after knee surgery. Wide out. It was just a nice committee of them. Milton on third down delivers a strike across the middle. The field goals tonight for Michigan. He won a tight battle against Quinn Nordine. And from 38 yards, he missed it. Slides wide right. So Michigan texts his receiver just to catch up. The news was delivered. Lyman's dream to get abort that fake and get over there. He's got to see this, feel this, and get over here and help out. He does it. And when you don't, your quarterback's in no man's land. Boom. Big hit there. Good call by Don Brown. Balls. He's a rough start for this Michigan defense as a gopher scored in two plays. Morgan from the pocket. Takes a downfield shot. And coming back to making the catches off and Bell. Reacted beautifully to the play. Can't have complete confidence. But good job by the holder to get that ball down. Stevenson is pressed into duties. Walker has been hitting the variety of kickoffs, none of them deep, and now Wolverines are going to have a chance here. Barrett in the clear. Gets away from the kicker. Barrett down the sidelines gets a block and is finally going to be knocked out inside the tent. <laughs> Milton still got the ball, throws it in the flat. Mason diving toward the pylon. He's in. Ben Mason. He didn't score a touchdown all of last year. Makes a very athletic dive for the pylon. And the Wolverines stretch the lead. And a look here at the end. Well, he's known as a blocker, but good job. The, the only thing they might look at is that right hand that he had. One of the guys in this strange challenging off field as the Gophers begin quarter number two in a second and short and they'll move the six out to the 40. Fake it to Ibrahim on the slant and the catch is made. Bateman draws it. He's got it again. Cuts back to the right this time. Fighting down, banging down near the goal line and there's a touchdown. Just broke the play. A physical Drive. Well, how about the bounce right at the line of scrimmage? Looks like Michigan may have a chance to, to slow him down. And he bounces out to the outside, gets outside, and he's got that low center of gravity able to shake through it. Boy, he extends right there. It's more than five and a half minutes. Ibrahim in the ground game. For the play action. Look 
going to take a downfield shot, and it's a high pass delivered in the arsenal, not just the fastball now. Flip it in the flat. A.J. Henning is a true freshman with speed. You can see the acceleration. As Stop the Wolverines here. And Milton breaks through. Darts down the sidelines. It'll be dragged in. Running back Haskins in direct snap formation. He's got it, and he scores standing up. So a little goal line wrinkle and a bunch of good blocking up front. And the Wolverines answer with the long touchdown drive to stretch the lead again. Jalen Mayfield finishes block 73, puts the defender right on his back right there. Harris taking direct snaps other than Milton here. Is drawing in traffic. It's a fake on the direct snap, and it goes nowhere. The Wolverines were ready for the fake. Not fooled at all. How about Has Haskins, a former linebacker? Who Michigan barrels into the end zone. Lowering the head and getting in was Hassan Haskins. And the fake punt attempt backfires. Wolverines with a short field build this lead. Just a 29-yard drive in four plays. Yeah, this new offensive line has done a really good job here in the first half. Moving people around, especially they get into these short yardage and goal line communicating well in this first half. They were confident about that. You wondered how you could lose pressure. They back out of it. Milton has time from the pocket, delivers short. And Evans out of the backfield will be right in eight yards. And he drives the ball, but it's drifting, and it's wide left. So Michigan on air. Hey, everybody. I'm Wheels. Make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss a video. All right. Enjoy the second half highlights. <laughs> Big dive for him. Morgan rolls and throws, and the catch is made. And on second and ten, they fake it to him. Morgan throws a slant. Bateman cuts back and finally gets space. And number zero. For him again. Dives into the end zone, and the Gophers respond with an impressive drive to open the third quarter. The 11 plays, 71 yards, and Mo Abraham was the workhorse. The left side, watch the two tight ends right here, along with the left tackle, just push this and open it up. They, they just do a really good job getting a hat on a hat and pushing people around and getting down in that area. 89 yards rushing with tailback. And the PAT, yeah, the electric 70 yard run back in the game. They fake it to him. Milton trying to make something happen on the run. And the ball was attempted, it found its way to those coverage fronts, his scheme. So I'm not necessarily shocked, even though he doesn't have. Chris Evans back in the game. Milton fakes it to him and just flips it short. They give him a chance to redeem himself. All off and running and spins down inside the five. And he said, yeah, we have. Come to think of it. <laughs> it's Milton with the keeper, patiently following his blocks and just muscling into the end zone. So Michigan answers the long touchdown drive from the Gophers with one of their own. That is how you respond. If you're a championship caliber team, home team gets a big drive to try to get back into the drive as the Wolverines try to maintain them on the opening kickoff and they went over Tennessee. Just hate to see one of the great playmakers in the sport sideline. Abraham breaks free and he's well over 100. March the field. He was the featured guy. They fake it to him. Morgan takes about a downfield shot. This is Bateman trying to fight back. And he makes the catch despite. And Morgan scrambling, scrambling. Has it at all, but back in the end zone. And just flat out missed Ibrahim, who worked clear. Nope. For the Gophers, but Michigan's defense makes a stand on fourth down. And now breaking free is Haskins. Haskins being chased down. But he busts a long run. It'll finally be grabbed by the jersey at the 30-yard line by Cody. For Sevens is in motion. Milton fires over the middle. And the catch is made. That's a Romans. And Evans has it. Can he get there? Spins and dives and scores a touchdown for the first time since late 2018. And you can see what it means to his teammates who congratulate him. Great to see Evans get 
into the end zone after, again, we've talked a lot tonight, everything he's been through to be able to be welcomed back to this team. Good block again, man. I, if you're back, just follow manage this game. Powerful ground game. Wolverines had the first one and will shake up the maze and blue nation. We'll get to Maria momentarily for that. The completion to Bell on the edge, who breaks free. Ronnie Bell still running, lowers his shoulder, and is out. We're all, we're all so much disbelief. We waited till the fourth quarter to report it. On the slant, Bell breaks free. Did he get there? No! And it stumbles and falls. Heading into week two. It's a low snap. It's actually put down pretty effectively there by the holder. Will Hart has also been an eventful night in special teams. Morgan rolls out and throws an interception. Right into the hands of Josh Ross, who's still running. There's a flag and return as he's dragged down at the nine-yard line. And the first interception of the night, Hey, provide the pressure. You know, he got hurt. He just reads the eyes of Tanner Morgan right in the middle. Just kind of senses it, does a good job, good awareness of knowing that the back faces a fourth and six here. Gophers bring pressure against the young guy who just launches it for the end zone and could not get the ball to Giles Jackson out there. It brought the 